what's going on guys, it's your boy Land Play Survive. And today we're gonna be talking about the new Fortnite update that's coming out tomorrow. So yeah, let's get into it. So first off I should start off that saying that the new update's coming out on January 18, 2018. And I have a whole bunch of information I have to tell you guys about the new update. So like from weapons to bug fixes, gameplay, bugs fixes again and the world and all their stuff like that. So let's just get up into it. So yeah, I have it on the screen. Uh, well, not you, not on your screen. You, right now you're seeing Fortnite gameplay. But um, I see all the list of crap. So yeah, so let's start. So for weapons, they removed the scope they are from supply drops, which I'm kind of glad they did that because I was tired of getting those out of supply drops. Um, Updated the scope for the scope they are, so they changed the scope. Place the old arrow re retisel with a more modern design. It should be easier to tell where you're aiming and where your crosshair actually is. So yeah, like the um the little icon thing, the arrow thing, when you aimed with the gun, um scope they are. Uh, it used to be hard to see where you were supposed to aim, so now it's easier. Um, snowball launcher has been replaced by the normal grenade launcher. Slightly increased the size of grenade loot, so they increased the size a little bit. Okay, these are some bug fix fixes. Fix frag and smoke grenades exploding on impact when hitting shallow waters. So yeah, that was an issue that people were having. Fixed an issue where the grenade toss animation ended prematurely when tossing the last grenade in the stack. So that was a glitch. I actually experienced that glitch. Um, it was really annoying. Um, the boogie bomb effect will now kick players out of weapon targeting. So no more. Well, it will kick them out of weapon targeting. So, players can no longer place traps while affected by the boogie mom. People used to be able to do that. Explosions affect now play pro properly on water surfaces. Water surfaces like Loot Lake. Now, here's some gameplay changes. Friendly Fire is now disabled, which is already active the friendly fire um this is exploratory and subject to change we will be closing eva evaluating this and want your feedback so they want your feedback on that players will now immediately aim their weapon upon landing on the ground if they press and hold the aim button while in the air okay pickups no longer take priority over reviving dbno squad members Nice. Empty chest and metal street lights will no longer block players from building. Nice. That was always annoying. Corn stalks are now destroyed upon taking any damage. Oh, those were annoying. You shot them. They never freaking broke. Here's some more bug fixes. There's a lot. Just did how ammo crates drop ammo so they don't overlap the ammo box itself sometimes you used to go through it attempting to use a scope while playing an emote will now cancel the animation okay fixed an issue that prevented players from picking up eliminated players items well that, ha that actually happened to me dennis and dylan in a game it was floating and it wouldn't let us pick up the, the stuff and he had pretty good stuff but wouldn't let us pick it up um where did I left off? Over here. Fixed an issue. Fixed a few issues which caused supply drops to pass through player built structures. Oh, that was a big one. I've seen a lot of people who had the um, crate drop into their base and it would just glitch. Either you couldn't open it, it would glitch through the floor, or something else would happen. Um, fixed an issue where which caused a trap to do no damage if a ramp or roof is placed in front of the trap. That used to be possible. Build mode visuals no longer persist when 
using a launch pad or when knocked into the DBNO state. Let me just get rid of that thingy. Fix an issue that allows allowed players to see through the smoke grenade effect while scoped. That used to be an issue I, I had. I experienced that a lot. You can now move forward and backwards while gliding to f when facing straight up and down. Okay. Cozy campfire, cozy campfire trap no longer heals eliminated players. So the ones that are down, they won't get healed. Fix an issue which caused the glider to sometimes deploy sideways after a using a launch pad. Oh, that happened to me before. And we're getting to the bottom. Um, this is about the world. The map has been updated with many new points of interest, biomes, and more. Players now interact with grass and foliage as they walk through it. Okay. So what I mean, I think they mean is like when you walk through it, I think it like moves or something. I don't know. Um, added water effects when entering and exiting water. So like splashes, I think. Added a new post pro process effect for when your camera goes below the water surface. Okay. It, it will look, now look like you are actually underwater and you can no longer see for an infinity distance. Well, infinite distance. Yeah, people used to do that and they could see. I actually did that before. I um, could see them and they couldn't see me. I'm like, bam, 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 bam. Added ammo boxes to Dusty Depot. There was never ammo boxes in Dusty Depot. Wait. Increase the amount of metal harvest from shipping containers. So you get more metal from shipping containers. One more bug fix. Bug fix. Water no longer blocks bullets or projectiles. That actually happened to me a lot. I would always freaking duck down. The water would block the bullets. I'm like, yeah, boy. Uh, now for the item shop. Starting on January 17, 2018, players should see six daily sto store slots instead of four. Starting on January 21, 2018, the weekly item shop is changing to the featured item shop. Offers will, offers will update twice, a week, twice weekly instead of once. And I think that's all. Oh, there's way more. Mm, nothing really important. Oh, audio. Added new audio for pickaxes that were previously used using default swinging sounds. Okay. So, yeah. Added a pickup sound effect for the damage trap. Okay. More bugs. General. Voice chat now supported in the pre-game lobby. Oh. Cosmetic items can now be rotated in the locker and store pages left left click or drag or and drag or use the right thumbstick on the controller to rotate them remove the winter theme from the pre-game lobby no i love that um yeah that's basically all the new updates for the xbox um fortnite uh update so they're, they're adding a lot of different things, going from audio to the map to, like, what else? <laughs> Bugs fixed. Um, what else was there? Weapons, gameplay, like, all of that stuff. The item shop. So, yeah. Now, if this, if this is, um, if my gameplay is longer than, uh, this um face cam then uh enjoy watching the rest of it but if it's already over and you're just seeing the full face cam because i don't remember how long that how long the fortnite gameplay was but yeah this is all almost 10 minutes it's 9 45 but yeah so if there's still leftover fortnite gameplay to watch enjoy that but if there's not i'll see you in the next one guys
Pois.